I sent 23,000 DMs on Instagram for my social media marketing agency. Here is what happened. Have you ever wondered what would happen if you sent 23,000 DMs on Instagram for your business? Well, I did it. Let me tell you how and also if it's worth it. I decided to test an organic way to get clients for my business. I have invested considerably in paid advertising to get more clients via webinars and via sales. At some point, my customer acquisition cost went up and I thought, why not to try a new method called Instagram organic outreach. To start sending Instagram DMs, I needed a list of businesses. And to make that business list, I had to use specific Instagram business pages strategically. For example, my niche was e-commerce jewelry stores. And for that, I had to search for particular magazines, companies or organizations where most of the followers are jewelry businesses. Here, for example, Acta, American Gem Trade Association, a page that is followed by jewelry business owners. If you are looking to target dentists or dental clinics, for example, you can search for Straumann, a dental uh, uh, implant provider. Most of the followers are dentists and dental clinics. I also used other suggestions that appear directly on Instagram when you follow a specific page like you see here. Every lead we found was placed in our Excel file where I had the company name, Instagram handle, page URL, website, DM status and comment status. I had a rule that once we send the DM, then I ask my virtual assistants for a comment on their Instagram post. This improved our DM read and replay ratio. To get best possible results with this strategy, you have to optimize your Instagram account. You need professional content on your account, ideally customer reviews to improve your conversion rate. I recommend recording some professional videos about what you do, some strategies, asking someone to give you a nice review and placing it in your feed. I also recommend boosting these posts with Instagram ads to get some followers and engagement. I personally didn't have enough time to execute the strategy on my own, so I decided to hire a virtual assistant from the Philippines via Upwork, link in the description. I paid $3 per hour during the working day. My goals were to find 100 quality leads and send 100 DMs. Before outsourcing, I didn't have a clear picture of the strategy. I just started doing it and then optimized the steps during the process. What type of DMs did I send? It was tough to convince someone to work with me with simple conversations. The big question is what messages did I send to get their interest and curiosity? This was my message. Hello, hope you are doing well. I spotted your aesthetically appealing products on your Instagram feed and decided to reach out to you. I helped jewelry companies to X2, X5 their current sales in less than six months using holistic marketing strategies on advertising and website levels. I just recorded a personalized video for you showing some of the strategies. What is the best email to send my video? Thank you, Alexander. Why do I need their email address? The email address was used to send a personalized long video recorded by my virtual assistant and of course for our email marketing strategy. Here's an example of the video. I want to talk with you through Instagram and I would like to thank you for providing your email address. As promised in this video, I want to share a little bit about us and the rest of the video is about how we can help you through it. The video starts with saying hello using their SEO's name and showing their website on the screen. The rest is scripted showing some of the clients strategies and results. At the end of the video, there was a button to book an appointment via Calendly. This button also available during the video. What was my email marketing strategy? I used Lemlist to send automated email marketing campaigns. Of course, the first email had a link to a personalized Loom video and the rest of the emails were about e-commerce strategies and my customer reviews. Almost every email had a link to an initial Loom video and a book appointment link. In total, I sent around 12 emails in two months. To execute this strategy, I used few software solutions, Lemlist to send emails, Loom for video recording and Calendly to book appointments. Here are some challenges that I faced with this particular strategy. We started to reach out and after 50 messages, our account was restricted for 24 hours. I realized that the only way to get results with this Instagram outreach is to use multiple accounts. For that, I needed to clone my main account multiple times. So I had to create 
create additional Instagram clones of my account to keep up with the volume of messages I needed to send daily without a volume of messages, at least 200-300 messages a day, you will not feel any success with this particular strategy. I ended up managing four virtual assistants, three were researching and sending DMs and one was working on recording Loom videos and placing new leads into email marketing automation. Some virtual assistants tried to scam me by basically not efficiently working or even staying for hours without activity. I think I lost few thousands dollars on it, if not more, so I highly recommend paying per task and not per hour. Another problem that I faced was speed of execution or limits of the niche. Once you get a lot of leads, searching for new leads becomes harder and harder, which limits the speed of finding and sending new messages. So cold outreach is not something that is going to work forever as a strategy, especially if you are dealing with one single B2B niche, you will face limitations. How much do I actually spend to send 23,000 DMs? Well, most of the money went towards my virtual assistant. So I spent here number one, 2,600, number two, almost 6,000, number three, almost 6,000 again, number four, almost 2,000 and number five, 3000 and something. So at some point I had even five virtual assistants. So in total I spent $19,000 and something. So it's not a free strategy. You still have to pay money to get it running. How much do I earn? Well, I earned around $30,000 from contracts minus $19,000 that were spent towards virtual assistants minus taxes minus my time and expenses. And I got around seven, six thousand uh, dollars in my pocket in few months. Is it good? Well, this solution is exceptional for beginners and professionals. It is also great to sell services or products that are more expensive, over $5,000 and have less competition and a higher conversion rate. I send DMs to the people who don't know about myself, but if I were sending these DMs to people who follow or engage with my Instagram page, the results would be much better. If you sell high ticket services, I highly recommend hiring a virtual assistant and letting him work with your Instagram followers and engage your sending DMs every day to the people who already know about you. Outreach is still a good strategy when you have the right offer. My package was $2,000 and the offer was not as profitable as possible because of the offer price, niche and competition. Would I use this strategy again? Absolutely yes, with another market and offer and with better management costs. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoy it, please like this video, comment, share it and subscribe to my channel. This will help me to produce more content like this.